Me, I'm ready to go anytime. Bill Bevins has been on the radio almost since the day he graduated from Meadowbrook High School 31 years ago. Almost all that time right here in Richmond. He did take a job briefly in the Northeast that lasted about a year back in 1975. Went up there to do a morning show in Providence and about froze to death. And, <laughs> and said, no, this isn't for me. So I came on back. Good morning, folks. And did he come back? He's now riding the crest of rating success by himself in this cramped studio with barely room for a visiting reporter. Both the news and traffic anchors are piped in from separate downtown studios. John Ogle. Good morning, Bill. The geographic. Look at this technology. No logs to fill out, no records to queue up, just a state of the art computer that tightly guides him through the show. In fact, here's the list. From the top, you see a commercial, song, song, news traffic and so on that thing right there is a way to record callers and put them on the air with some editing I'll just, I'll just use that part of it and then cut that 30 seconds of uh, conversation down to about 10. Like 98 it's his listeners love him critics call him too bland almost vanilla then uh, get you some chocolate uh, <laughs> it, it, it's uh, it's not meant to be shocking I mean we go to great efforts to make it not shocking so uh, that's a compliment, I guess. Now, how do you study for a spelling bee? In fact, edgier shows might not take the time to interview an eighth grade spelling bee winner. But appealing to the most people as possible and offending the least has taken Bill all the way to the top of Richmond Radio. We've got great music. Uh, the station is very focused on, on the listener and, and serving the listener. And, um, you know, hopefully I add a little bit to it. That pollen blow right in your His face. His fans say he adds more than just a little bit. Here's Bruce Springsteen on a most music morning on Light 98.